Chrysler back to receive for the pickup. On your feet, let's go! And the kickoff is going to go to Johnny Heisler as he takes it up in the air. Gets in behind a couple blockers in the middle of the field. And he is brought down by number eight, Blake Caricature. And a split set, wide receiver to both sides, Wesson and Quilvang. And Kamrowski out of the shotgun. They're looking to set up a screen. And Heisler, Kamrowski is going to be sacked way back at about the... And the handoff goes to Riley Thomas, and he's got a little bit of room off the right side as he tripped up. 28 yards. Kamrowski's back in the shotgun. Wide receiver both sides. And he's looking to go up top to Quilvang right away. And that ball's underthrown and intercepted by number 21, Keaton Smith. Trent Carroll will be a quarterback, and he'll hand off to number 34. That's Brock Robinson. He takes it down the right side, runs over Packer, and pushed out of bounds. But Kevler comes back out in a tight set. Two tight ends, two running, or full house running back. And that ball is handed off to number 21, Keaton Smith. And he's brought down in the middle. Brings up second down and about 13. Quick handoff to Brock Robbins, and he's brought down in the backfield as I believe Ryan Solseth field, and it'll be quarterback keeper going the other direction. He's got a lot of room down the left edge, and it looks like he's going to go into the end zone. And he is in Trent Carroll. For the first few plays, anyway. Yeah, Cavalier, that's oh, a geez. interesting combination there. It's the big old big old wedge up the middle and snap the ball and move forward. And that's a good Okay, we're back on. Scoring summary for Cavalier. To, uh, took two minutes and five seconds on 28-yard touchdown run by Trent Carroll. And the Cavalier kicks the ball off, and that ball is going to go into the end zone for a touchback. And they come out with single wide receiver to both sides. Eye backfield, Kamrowski under center. He turns and he hands the ball off to Riley Thomas as he's off to the right edge. And looks like he's going to be brought down for a short yard. And, uh, wide receiver to both sides. Kamrowski in the backfield with Heisler to his left. And out of the shotgun, Kamrowski's going to throw the short slant to Weston and he's going to pick up a first down. And there's another short, quick hitter to Quillivang, and he gets by the first guy. And he two six four, or six four, and six five on the outside. I'd, we need to exploit that as much as possible. And there's a nice little dive up the middle to Johnny Heisler, and he's going to pick up a first down. Viewers, that the clock is not official. And there's a quick hitter, and that ball is almost intercepted. Second and ten, single receiver to each side, and. Single receiver to each side. Split backs in the backfield. Kamraski will be out of the shotgun. Snap back. Oh. Ooh. And tried the screen pass to Thomas. Single receiver to each side. Single back. Kamraski out of the shotgun once again. Takes a snap. And he's going to hit the slant to Weston. And that's going to be completed for a first down. And now the Bearcats have come out in doubles to each side. Single back in the backfield. Kamraski. Looking to hit short, and that ball is going to be swatted down. High backs in the backfield, hand off to Riley Thomas, and that ball comes out. And Kamrowski sitting back there waiting for it. Single wide receiver to each side. Weston up top, Quilving on the bottom, and there's the slant and go. Kamrowski's got to get out of trouble as he's being chased. And he's being ridden towards the out-of-bounds line, and he just steps out of bounds wisely. And North Star comes out in their doubles formation again. Two wides to each side, single back, and Kamarowski takes the ball. And he's being tracked and chased. And he's got Wesson down the right side, and that's completed. And I got popped out of bounds pretty late. I, and we got first and down, first down and 10 from about the 13 yard line. And they're going to go up top to Weston with the fade. He should have the mismatch there, and that's called in by Weston. Nice slow and catch from Kurowski to Weston. Good time by the offensive line. And that brings And Kurowski's back to attempt the extra point. Good snap, good hold, and it looks good from here. And it is. It brings a score. Or excuse me, Jaden Kurowski to Alex Weston. 
And set to kick off will be Ryan Solseth. And that ball is live in the middle of the field there, and it is picked up. And he will be brought down by. Anywhere as close to being official. T backfield and run across Buck, and there goes Robbins, and he's off to the races. And I don't know if anybody's going to catch him except for Riley Legacy, be the only one that would have an opportunity. And he cannot quite get there. And that is a. 72 yard scan again and the quarterback will just follow in right behind Cavaliers big number 25 Dylan Stevenson will be back to kick off for Cavalier and that ball is going to be taken by Riley Thomas at about his 15 yard line he comes off the left side and a good return good field position start here for North Star at 6 or 6-7 six, and it looks like now that Cavalier has gone to a uh, Cover two, safety over the top, and Kamraski is the quick out to Quilvang, and that'll be a loss. Short routes, nothing over the top, as they got a, they've got a safety over top of Wesson and Quilvang here, and they're just going to rely on their guys up front to take control, and there's a short route underneath. Oh, there should be a late hit. Well, I don't... Non-completion will be an interception. Single wide to each side. Kamraski goes back and hits a slant to Wesson again, and that's a catch and a first down. The safety had Wesson lined up there. Single receiver to each side once again. Kamrowski in the short or shotgun and quick cut plays out to Christian Quilving and he makes one guy miss. And that looks like he's going to be. And they come out with doubles to the left side, split back in the backfield. Kamrowski in the shotgun. And. And Kamrowski in the shotgun. Takes a snap and they run the draw up the middle. Oh, and he got his helmet ripped off, and that's going to be a 15-yarder. Strifle legacy on the bottom. Weston and Kulving up top. Johnny Heisler in the backfield. Kamarowski takes a shotgun snap, and they run a little twist route. And the ball is an intense cap, and hopefully just a cramp, as we can't afford to lose anybody else. And there's the give, the short dive, the give up the middle to facility for them. Single wide to each side. Kamrowski in the shotgun, and he's got Weston coming across the middle, and Kamrowski scrambles, and he just throws one out there to Weston. Basketball season. Yeah, he's been in the weight room. That's for sure. Single wide to each side once again. Kamrowski back. Takes a snap, the shotgun, throws one up to Corbin, and he comes down with an amazing grab. He had it in the air, lost it, and grabbed it out of the air on his way down, and that's going to be... Um, 13-yard line here now for the Bearcats, and Kamrowski takes the ball in the backfield, and Com Weston comes back and catches a short pass. Wide to each side, Strifle to the left, Weston up top, and Kamrowski takes one in the backfield, and looks like they're setting up screen, and Jaden's going to be have to scramble away on this one, and throw hopefully it. he throws the ball and gets rid of it, and he does throw it to Heisler. He was able to... North Star has eaten up about four minutes on the first quarter clock here with this drive, and Kamrowski takes a shotgun snap, and it sends out to the right. Caught by Weston, and he's going to be inbounds. Looks like he... And now Kamrowski goes under center. Heisler in the backfield, and he turns and hands the ball off, and he is met in the middle out of the shotgun, single wide to each side. And he takes a snap, and should be a nice, easy catch to throw ring in the middle, and it is... And that's a three-yard touchdown pass from Kamraski to Quilvang with two points oh, going for two. four minutes and 48 seconds. And now North Star has come out and looking like they're going to go for the two-point conversion as they're going to need to get these two-pointers counted for. And here comes Christian in the jet motion, and that ball is snapped over top of Kamraski's head. And picked up by Kamarowski, and he'll be. Imagine that we're going to be able to stop them. Yeah, and by the looks of our, you know, we've we've scored against them on one out of three drives, so we'll see if they can stop our passing game. Yeah. Solseth boots one over to the left side, and he just yeah. plainly kicks that one out of bounds, and maybe that backfield. Once again, they'll be running the crossbuck motion, two to two to right side, and one to the left, and he'll be met by Heiser, and the ball comes out. And I have a feeling forward progress was stopped. I heard a whistle before that ball came out. Second quarter action here as Cavalier goes back to that T formation and just a simple handoff to Robbins off the right side. And he is 100 yards rushing. Power eye backfield. 
And back to the horse for Cavalier. It'll be Robbins. And that'll be a nice gang tackle. And Trent Carroll under center with the T backfield once again. Quilvin gets chopped down on the outside edge. And Keaton Smith with about three yards on the carry. It brings up second down and four is what they have on the scoreboard. for the Tornadoes and they hand it off to Robbins and that's pretty simple up the middle. Nobody was even there to touch him on the dive. Cavalier up the middle for two yards. Cavalier set to kick off and kicks deep right taken at about the 15 yard line. Back there by Riley Thomas it appears and he's got a little bit of room up the middle. Penalty flag down on a play. Bearcats come out single wide to each side. No mystery there. They've been in this formation for about 80% of their plays so far. And the ball goes up top to Weston. Wow. And he comes down with it and fumbles the football. Pick it up. And it appears he is going to be near the end zone. Um, he'll be out of bounds at about the one yard line. It was the completion of about 15 yards. Um, and they're just going to turn and hand the ball off to number four, Andy Rintala. It appears, I think that was his number. To kick off for the Tornadoes, and that ball will be taken, backpedaling by Riley Legacy. And he slips and falls, and he's going to be down at the nine-yard line. Kumraski. Hands the ball off to Heisler, and he is going to be Heisler met in the middle. Here. Second down and seven here for the Bearcats. Kamraski takes it back, looking to set up the screen, and they've got something going here as the ball goes to Riley Thomas, and he picks up a first down. Second down and seven. Once again, we'll replay the down from the 13-yard line, and Kamrowski drops the pass. The ball goes up to Quilvang, and he comes down on a jump ball. And... Kamrowski's already at 150 yards passing for the game. And he's under center, and he turns and hands the ball off to Riley Thomas, and he is going to be taken down by two guys over top of each of our wide receivers on the edge. And... Their five guys are taking it two hours in the middle. And another, oh, that ball's dropped by Christian. Looks like he had it. Doubles to each side. Single back in the backfield. Kamarowski in the shotgun. Cavaliers coming with the blitz. Kamarowski gets rid of the ball on that ball. Kamarowski back to punt for the Bearcats. As Riley Clem will be back to receive. And Dylan Stevenson will be the up man. Kamrowski gets a nice kick away. And that's going to back Clem up. And we'll see if Legacy can get there. That's a heck of a punt right there. That edge a little bit. And Cavalier turns and... T backfield once again for Cavalier and that ball is taken by number 20 formation and he's going to turn and hand off to the big horse Robbins this time around and he's going to be chopped down it looks like by number doubles to the left side two backs in the backfield with Carroll in the shotgun and they run their jet motion and Probably a lucky play there is Keaton Smith. The ball was fumbled by the quarterback, and Keaton Smith was right there to grab it out of the air. That could have been a big play. Yeah, it could have been. The ball's on the ground. We got a shot at it. And off to the left side now is Stevenson, and there's possibly a flag coming here for a horse collar. Yep. Brings up first and ten. Two backs in the backfield. Behind Carroll and the handoff to Brock Robbins and he makes one cut up the middle and he's going to be in for the touchdown. Turns and this time quarterback keeper out in the left edge and he's in. 
Yeah. As Cavaliers leading 40 to 13, and that ball will be taken by Heisler, and he's going to be brought down by number two for the Bearcats, Kamrowski to the shotgun. And Northstar has a screen set up, and Heisler has gotten away from one guy, and he's going to be brought down there. Doubles formation once again. Heisler in the backfield. Kamrowski out of the shotgun. And Kamrowski takes a snap, and that's a quick little out hitter to Thomas, it appears. And he's going to be X for behind Kamrowski. And he turns and hands the ball off to the far back, and that's Riley Thomas, and he's held up at the line of scrimmage. Strutbacks, we'll see if Kamrowski just sneaks the ball and when it falls forward, should be able to get a first down, and I think he does. Points, but we need to, we need a big hitter here. Two wide each side, Kamrowski goes back and fires one up to Quilvang, and he's got a guy in, on the inside of him, and Christian just rises up and goes up and makes another spectacular catch. We, yeah, wow, well, we, yeah, we punted once and we fumbled it once. And Northstar comes back and doubles wide, and it looks like Cavalier is going to call a timeout. And 10 from their own 30-yard line. And Kamrowski takes a shotgun pass, quick out. we got a little small bubble screen set up there, and that goes to... Yeah. 2.03 left on the clock. I think Northstar would be content to have this clock run down a ways before they turn the ball over to... Cavalier, but hopefully they come away with some points. Kamrowski scrambles out to the right side and finds Weston down the right sideline. And he's going to be brought down at about the 19. Shared the ball around pretty well here with his two top targets. Brings up first and 10 from about the 19-yard line. Kamrowski turns and hands the ball off to Johnny Heisler. And finally, 27 left in the second quarter. Down 40 to 13 here to Cavalier. And the ball is placed on the nine yard line. First and goal for the Bearcats. And Coach Haugen sends a wide receiver to each side. Christian up top. And Kamrowski with eye backs behind him and he turns and hands the ball off to Heisler and he's pounding the ball up the middle. Single back to, or single wide to each side. Kamrowski's under center this time. And he turns and hands the ball off to Thomas and he is once again met right at the line. Single back, or single wide each side. Once again, Kamrowski in the shotgun. He goes back and he's got Alex Weston on an out route and Kamrowski's gonna be in trouble and he needs to scramble and he needs to scramble a long ways. Colving gotta get rid of the ball. Uh, Weston, um, and that was covered nicely by the D-backs from Cavalier and Kamrowski scrambled and was looking downfield for somebody, but he was finally caught for a loss of about, you know, whatever it was, 10 or 15 yards. Brings up third and 17. Kamrowski goes back, and he's looking to go up top to Weston. He's got a wide open man. That's a touchdown. Kamrowski to Weston. 17 yards out, 17 yard hookup, and that's big coins for the Bearcats. Two-point conversion upcoming for the Bearcats. Heisler, Riley Thomas in the backfield, excuse me. And Kamrowski goes back, and he is going to be planted. Hopefully make it tough for Cavalier to handle. Yeah, and that's exactly what it is. He just pounds that football into the ground, and it's a live ball over there. And that's going to be picked up at about and made a mistake. But North Shore's got three defensive or three D-backs deep, and the quarterback's just going to keep it out to the left side. And let's keep him in the middle of the field, though. And that should clock a stop for the movement of the chip. And the score is 42-19. And we're just about ready to get underway here with the third quarter. Um, Ryan Solseth back to kick off for the Bearcats. And he kicks a short squibber taken by one of the upmen from Cavalier. That's number 20, Brady Morton. And he takes it all the way over to the right sideline. And there's... Cavalier comes up with a single wide receiver to the top and the full house backfield. Two running backs. And Carroll turns around and hands the ball off to Brock Robbins. 
and he's toe tapping around over there on the sideline and he is down the right side one man to beat and it looks like he was brought down but he was able to stay on his feet and North Star's got guys jump a gain of 47 yards there for Brock Robbins and now Carroll turns and hands the ball off to Brock Robbins over to the right side and he'll be in for a touchdown 12 yard touchdown run by Brock Let's see what kind of formation Cavalier comes out in now once again the T backfield and Carroll turns and hands off to Brock Robbins over the right edge and we'll see if the Bearcats can rally up and they cannot Robbins tiptoes into the, the kick here from Stevenson and the kickoff is away and that looks like it's headed towards out of bounds and it does go out of bounds and the Bearcats and Kamroski's back in the shotgun nothing's changed offensively formation wise for the Bearcats Kamroski takes a snap and he's in trouble in the backfield we'll see if he can get away and he cannot as he is sacked you can't just throw the football away in high school you have to have a receiver in the area and there's a screen set up and that's Brock Robbins read that nicely. Single receiver to both sides. Kamarowski in shotgun. Takes a snap. And he's looking to go up top once again. In trouble. And he'll be brought down. Go back to punt. His last punt went for 63 yards. And we'll see if they can turn the table again on this one. And he is roughed. And there's going to be a running into the kicker penalty by Cavalier. As that ball tails down to the sideline. Starter takes over after the personal foul penalty in the slant to Weston, and that's an excellent, awesome catch there. There are really a lot of people talking about it here at halftime. Single wide receiver to each side, and there's another oh. slant, and that one's read perfectly by Brock Robbins, and he will take that one back to the house. As he just sat and read Kamrowski's eyes on the slant, and he was right there to pick it off. Excellent catch to go here in the third quarter, and the clock is we are in that 30 lead, 30 point lead running clock time and North Star going to come up with a stop here or let's see what the signal is no good Finally, Stevenson back to kick off again and that ball will be taken by Heisler off the one hopper and he prances through the middle and lowers his shoulder and gets up to about Kamrowski receives the snap and turns the receiver to each side Kamarowski in the shotgun mm, Heisler standing next to him and the screen short little dump pass to Thomas and he gets hit pretty hard there lots of room down here on this side to Weston I am single coverage I'm going to like got a guy over the top the in the middle but I am going to say that the ball is going to come down here to this side on a stop and go and there it was and Kamarowski's in trouble and I don't think he's getting out of this one. And he had a 15 yard loss on the sack. Um, of Jaden Kamraski sends it fourth down in about 24 for North Star. Kamraski's going to have to go back and punt. He's had two punts, one of 55 and one of 63. And that one he just gets off in a hurry. And that ball once again gets sent down there. And out at about the 23. Going good for your team when punting is the <laughs> highlight our, of the our game. big gainers. Two wide receivers at the top for Cavalier in jet motion. He's going to turn around and hand it off to the motion guy. North Star is trying to fill, and Keaton Smith is down the sideline. He's going to be run out of bounds by Riley Legacy. And Cavalier goes single wide to each side. Carroll turns around, hands it off to Brock Robbins and he stumbles. Carroll takes a snap from the shotgun, hands off to Robbins and he's out and running once again. And he's a tough man to bring down. He stiff arms one guy and he's out of bounds. On. Power eye and the handoff to the off back in 21. That's uh, Keaton Smith and he's going to take it in for another Cavalier touchdown. Two point conversion attempt for Cavalier and there's their first pass of the game and that ball is incomplete. Intended for Cody Walton. 
Stevenson back to kick off. And that ball is going to be taken by Heisler off of the two hopper. He fumbles the ball around a little bit. Little room up the middle to run. And he takes it out to about the 33 yard line. And that's where North Acker single wide to each side. Eye backs behind him. And he's going to turn off and turn around and take give the dive to Riley Tom. We've got the aerial attack. And went hard count. And this will probably be the last play of the third quarter. And Karnowski turns and hands the ball off to Legacy. He dances around and comes up with a nice little game there. Back to start the fourth quarter here. Karnowski in the shotgun. And he gives a little pump fake. And he's going to go down. As we subtract our sacks from our passing yards, we don't have much left. No. And Kamarowski goes back to punt, and this one will be taken uh -oh. by number 21. That's Keaton Smith, and he's off to the races, down to the right side. The only guy left to block is Kamarowski, and he just gets out of the way. Cavalier. T backfield. Carroll turns around and hits the reverse guy, and that is Blake Carricker on Eisler back to return. And this one will be taken by Thomas. And he's going to hopefully get in there behind Heisler. And he found a little crease up the middle as he gets spun around but stays on his feet. And now he's out to the right side. And he gets all the way to about the 43. And Good North comment made by the crowd there. North Star comes out first and 10. Karaski turns around and hands the ball off to Thomas. Ball comes loose, but he was. You got to make sure you're prepared to go, but. Score is 68 to 19, and it looks like several of their starters are still in the game. You know, you worry about an injury could happen very easily. As wide, Strifle up top, and Christian on the bottom. As Wesson looks like he's getting some attention to him on the sideline right now, and Riley Thomas is running for his life, and he'll be brought down. Kamarowski takes the snap. And gets away a kick, and that'll be taken. Quilving runs it down. Smart move. And Riley Clem takes over at quarterback as the Cavalier goes with that T lineup in the backfield and hands the ball off to number 17, Casey Christensen. And he's going to be knocked out. That guy's beat up all over the place. Run off to the right side, and Christian Quilving makes a tackle. Wow. And Clem under center, T backfield behind him, and they're going to run the reversal over to the right side. And that goes to number 12, Taylor Morin, and he's off to the races. And it looks like snap goes to Clem, and he's going to follow his blockers out to the left side as another flag on the play. And 51's begging and pleading that he didn't do anything, but I'm assuming this play is coming back once again. A lot of playing time out there now for some second stringers for both teams. As Clem under center takes a snap, hands it off to the first guy through. No, my mistake. Hit the reversal. Number 24, Cody Walton. And he picks up another first down for the Tornadoes. Is that Legacy on the Who's I didn't see which number was over there. 20. I see a lot of playing yeah. time except for this game. Formation wise, they haven't run a lot of uh, mysteries. They've come right at you. It's going to the edge. And that ball is Austin Erlab, and he's going to be down for uh, about a gain of. You'd expect a kneel down, but doesn't look like you're going to get that either. Casey Christensen. Star 19. And as far as I can tell, we made it through an entire game without the computer crashing for the first <laughs> time. 